Hello, my name's Craig Arms. I'm the Operations Manager for Dubbo Regional Council. A part of my job is to oversee the watering of our sporting fields, parks and gardens and trees around the local government area. And so with the introduction of uh, water restrictions on the 1st of June, that means we've had to change our watering regime. In accordance with Council's uh, drought management plan, we've shut down 30 parks uh, across the local government area. But that's not all of our parks. So sporting fields and our high priority regionally significant parks like Victoria Park and the Botanic Gardens here in Dubbo and also Cameron Park and Kennard Park in Wellington remain unchanged as well as the CBD uh, gardens as well. Some parks uh, are watered using grey water and so they're not covered under the ward restrictions. Those parks are the New Regan Park at the end of Teamworth Street, uh, Tidy Towns Park, Warunga Park and Bennis Park. They're all watered from grey water sourced from the John Gilbert Water Treatment Plant. Over the course of the water restrictions period, we will need to turn some of the irrigation on in those uh, shutdown parks. So it's from a maintenance reason. So. If we, if we don't do that, then we run the risk of, uh, of the irrigation hardware damaging, the, the seals drying out, and so to avoid that we need to run the irrigation only for a short period of time, maybe once a month. Also, Council waters around 500 trees on a, uh, on a rotational basis, uh, so that will continue also. Obviously not as much as we do in summer where the water truck is really going non-stop, but you'll still see uh, Council's water truck uh, out there watering trees over this period.